Welcome to Always Faded 420. Thank you guys for tuning in. I just thought I'd do a real quick strain review. I went and got me a quad of Durban Poison. And the bud tender told me that it was a pure sativa. I'm more of an indica man myself, but it's pure sativa. It originates from um, a port city, a South African port city called Durban. It's a very fruity and piney kind of smell tastes exactly like it smells it breaks up nice smokes great one thing I noticed so far is that it is very uplifting very energetic it's a very good high you know this is another one for the creative minds I did a previous video about Mac that was so far my best creative one but this one isn't too bad but I think this one's more for like if a motherfucker's trying not to snap throughout the day, smoke some of this shit and it'll calm you down. You know, this is more for the positive outlook. It looks really nice. You inhale it, you can feel it in your chest. It doesn't burn so much, it doesn't make you want to cough so much. You got some shit that will choke your ass out. You good, good strain so far. You know, I like it. I, I would recommend it. The more reviews I'm doing, the more I'm trying to get that five star review weed. You know, I've gotten a four star. I'd say this is probably about. I'd say probably a three star, you know, because it's not like where it gets you lit. It's just, it takes the edge off shit. You know what I mean? 70% is not bad, but like I said, I prefer my shit 20% or higher. Sometimes you got to take what you can get. Whatever the dispensary's got, sometimes the motherfucker got to take it. It really tastes the piney and fruity taste. It's, it's really crazy. It's hard to explain, but you can taste both of them and it tastes like piney fruit I don't know but very good strain pretty light green it's got a little little oranges I'll leave a picture so you guys can see it but if you guys ever had a dispensary and they have some Durban poison you never tried it and you like sativas I suggest you try this I'm more of an indica man myself like I previously said but you know I think from now on in my videos I'm going to use a different rating system. I'm still going to go 1 through 5, but instead of stars, I'm going to use bud plants. You get 5 bud plants, you the shit. You get 4 bud plants, not bad. You get 3 or less bud plants, you got to step your game up. But... I don't know. You guys let me know in the comment section what you guys think. Have you guys tried du Durban Poison? Do you guys like it? Do you like the taste? Does it smoke good to you? Let me know all that in the comment section. Please let me know what you guys think about the videos. And to the people who have been commenting, I really appreciate it. You guys know who you are. Thank you. You know, it's hard starting off with these channels. No one really gives you any kind of playtime. That's cool. I really just do this shit because for one, I smoke a lot. For two, I got a lot of different weed. And for three, I love this shit. But I appreciate you guys for tuning in. Please check me out on Instagram, Mr. Solo420, all lowercase. Until the next review, the next video comes, please like, subscribe, share, tell your friends about this shit. If you guys have any strains you want me to do, leave it in the comment section. But till the next video, I appreciate you guys tuning in. Appreciate the support. AF, stay faded.